Hi, hello, once again, this is yet another Minecraft video that you might want to... Oh yeah, it's been forever since I've done one of these. Well, it has. Now you might want to... Well, what am I doing in this castle right here? Well, you'll see what we're going to do with it. I'm actually showing you the uh, castle this time. So, first off... Alright, so first off, I'm going to show you this, a tour of this castle here. So, first off, when you come in, it says this because me and someone else won't dot it. <laughs> However, you see this down here as well. This I just recently added. So, actually I don't need that, but <laughs> if you come in, so there's two chests here. Pretty much just one of them has a whole bunch of arrows, the other one has a whole bunch of just weapons. So, have that. We have battles up there. Then we have this here. And we have these here, which are pretty much target, targets for uh, this here. No wonder. There it is. That's not one of those things, so, uh, oh no. Now, before I go. If you follow, go up here. So you just pretty much walk way earlier. And go to all this. Go up to here. Pretty much all the self secret area. And these here we have this chest full of all this stuff. We have a heal for that stuff. And then. Behind that, we have nothing. Okay, so... Now, we are going to go inside of it. Okay, wait for this. Okay. Now, first, it's not that exciting. Because, as you can see, we have a whole bunch of just doors here. But, no, let's not go in that area just yet. Let's go in this side area. Now, oh yeah, this is something. No, not that. This is something that, like, you use if, like, there's something bad happening. You just throw them down. And there they go. Pretty much what you do. If, like, a bad ammo comes in, you just mm -hmm. open up the trap doors, come down, close it. Mm -hmm. See? Yo, let me give you an example of that. So we have this animal heel. Just throw him down. Trap door. And I know a perfect way to get him down the uh, trap door. So you want to draw like that? Yeah. No. Good. And just wait a few minutes, like a few seconds or whatever, he should be down there. Okay. Now. You saw this earlier. You saw this earlier. You saw that room. Now we can pretty much... Yeah, I know it's just up here, but... Are you ready for this? Here we go. Three, two, one. Yeah, this is actually pretty good looking. Now, first off, we have three big, massive paintings here. With a whole bunch of torches around them. Yeah, back when I was a little bit younger, I would always think of redstone torches when provide the most for a light. By the way, we have this trail here with diamonds on it. And we have these two benches here for all the people to sit down at. Okay. Then we have all these trails here. This is kind of like a little table. Make a little table. This here is just like a closet. 
don't know why I added, I added that on now. And then this is like, I don't know, a or something else. I don't really know what it is, but it's just uses like a kitchen. Okay. Now, we can go upstairs. Now I think, oh yeah, that was a little heel. Well, we're not up there yet. You have this room here with just a whole bunch of beds in it. And then room with even more beds in it. These are like the guest bedrooms. This room has even more beds. This room, try to guess what it has in it. Yeah, if you guess beds, you are right. Try and guess again what this room has in it. You think beds? Well, that'd be wrong. <laughs> because this is the uh, laundry room. Complete with one washing machine and two dryers. I just wish. That throws your clothes out in the middle of each dryer when the cycle is over. Okay. Now, let's go back over there and see where that ladder takes us. Okay, that takes us into this room. Here with two beds. That thing, this thing. Which I put down to trick the other person, but she probably not going to see this for like about five years. This was just like a little outside area that we made up, but we'll look at it just a little bit. This here is my room. You know me, I believe in a multi-bed situation, so I have the, uh... Ward's longest bed! Go to sleep at night! <laughs> I'm sure you remember this all from way back when. And then... Let's actually see what happens. Okay. Now... Have a solar room. This is pretty much a library room. Nothing too special. Go down, we have this area again. Now let's see what that outside area is. So here is nothing except like these things. This is just another room. There we have. It goes completely around too. Mm -hmm. But it goes right back in here. But wait a minute. You think we're done yet? I don't think so. Mm -hmm. You can go up here. And then, this area can put you a whole bunch of stairs, which will go up in just a minute. And then we have CO treats out to my room. And then just around here we have this thing. Leads into the library room again. Well, book storage room. Whatever you want to call it, we have all these flowers here. Now, you might be jealous to see what these stairs lead up to. Yeah, auto save, yeah. What? This is like, I'll save it, I will be right back. Okay, don't take that long, but still goes me all the way back down, but this just sees right down here, and if we go up, yeah, hold on, if I can get up, it's pretty much like this view. Everybody think, oh yeah. Well, they all still take us to. Well, you'll see. Go right through here. Just guess what? They do the exact same thing. Exact same thing. Nothing different. Oh yeah. 
And by the way, this of this area, which is accessible if you go onto the side, or you go so go heal. I don't know why those are closed. Or like one of them, but we have this little tiny area right here, which. You see where it takes you? To the other side here. Mm -hmm. You could just go out again. And guess what? You can go back on the other side. Now. Mm -hmm. That's the entire this entire castle. This is what it looks like from follow away. Like, out of fun. Now, if I think, oh yeah, what is this all over here? Well, maybe it's like a woods slash jungle area. Now, you might wonder, oh yeah, how in creative, or I mean, when they were not in creative, how do we get up there? And that's where these. U.S. code violation stairs come in. <laughs> it says, no, no railings. Or <laughs> just stairs. So it goes up and up. But because they don't meet U.S. codes or violation, you can just go down like that. Mm -hmm. You won't want that if you're up high and you just fall down, would you? No. So in survival mode, I would like to go into a third person view for this. You could still get up to the top. Unbelievable, isn't it? <laughs> but at least I recommend third person view so that way you can actually see. So that way you know you are not going to fall off like that. <laughs> Eventually, I am going to add real links to this. Which I can figure out how. Okay, we're back into this area. Now, just jump up a few times and... There you are! Right back here. What's this there? Here, by the way. This is what it looked like if it was a dog on the day. So. Uh, like, this is what it looks like in the middle of the day. I haven't played much. Anyway. Okay, I might probably try that down a little bit. close look more vibrant but anyway that'll be it for this video so hopefully you enjoyed that don't worry i'll try and get to everything soon so yeah bye